Hello, and welcome back to Undertale. I believe we are going to the laboratory. Um, hello, here we are. Okay, that's me. There I am. It's you? Question mark? It's too dark to see near the walls. Interesting. Here we are. Hello. Dramatic. Oh man. She saw us. Oh my god. I didn't expect you to show up so soon. I haven't showered. I'm barely dressed. It's all messy and... She was awaiting my arrival. Um, hiya. I'm Dr. Alphys. I'm Asgore's royal scientist. But, uh, I'm not one of the bad guys. Actually, since you stepped out of the ruins, I've, um, been observing your journey through my console. Your fights, your friendships, everything. That's so exciting. I was originally going to stop you, but... Watching someone on a screen really makes you root for them. <laughs> She's my fan. So, uh, now I want to help you. Using my knowledge, I can easily guide you through Hotland. I know a way right to Asgore's castle, no problem! Well, actually, um, there's just a tiny issue. A long time ago, I made a, ro I made a robot named Metaton. Originally, I built him to be an entertainment robot. Um, you know, like a robotic TV star or something. Anyway, I recently decided to make him more useful. You know, just some small practical adjustments, like, um, anti-human anti combat features? Why would you do that? Uh, of course, when I saw you coming, I immediately decided I have to remove those features. Unfortunately, I may have made a teensy mistake while doing so. And, um, now he's un an unstoppable killing machine. What the fuck is wrong with my accent? Now he's on an unstoppable killing machine with a thirst for human blood? <laughs> huh. That's not good. That's not good at all. But, um, hopefully we won't turn into him. We won't run into him is probably what she said. Question mark? Oh, well, there he is. <laughs> Great timing. Did you hear something? I did. I think I did hear something, yeah. What's good? Oh no! Oh yes! Welcome, beauties! Drumroll. To today's quiz show! Yay! Wow, I'm on a game show. Oh boy, I can already tell it's gonna be a great show. Everyone give a hand for our wonderful contestants. That's me! Look at the confetti on me. That's so great. Never played before, gorgeous? No problem. It's simple. There's only one rule. Answer correctly, or you die. Or, or you die! <laughs> there you go. Metaton attacks. Alright. Uh, let's go ahead and cry. Screaming is against the rules. Let's start with an easy one. What's the prize for answering correctly? Uh, more questions. Right, sounds like you get it. <laughs> the quiz show continues. Yep, I'll just keep crying. Screaming's grass rolls, so. Here's your terrific prize. What's the king's full name? This one. Correct, what a terrific answer. Uh, let's check him, let's check him out. Uh, that's a lot of defense. His metal body renders him invulnerable to attack. Enough about you, let's talk about me. What are robots made of? Metal and magic. Too easy for you, huh? Uh, I guess I'll keep crying. Here's another easy one for you. Um, what the fuck? Yay! Wonderful, I'm astounded, folks. Me too, me too. Um, let's see, uh, let's spare him. Don't count on your victory. How many flies are in this jar? 
a lot. Yay! I'm so good at this. Wow. <laughs> Such a great guesser. Let's play memory game. What monster is this? Well, obviously that's Metaton. I'm so flattered you remembered. The quiz show continues. But can you get this one? Would you smooch a ghost? Heck yeah. Great answer, I love it. Here's a simple one. How many letters in the name Metaton? Shit. Oh no. No, no, no. Can you not read? <laughs> Time to break out the big guns. It's a dating simulation video game. Mew Mew Kissy Cutie. What is uh, Mew Mew's favorite food? Um. Looks like Alfie's nose. <laughs> yeah. It's very powerful messages about friendships, apparently. Alfie's, Alfie's, Alfie's. You aren't helping our contestant, are you? Oh, you should have told me! I'll ask a question. You'll be sure to know the answer to. Who does Dr. Alfie's have a crush on? Undyne! Yes! <laughs> See, Alfie's, I told you it was obvious. Even the human figured it out. Yes, she scrawls her name on the, in the margins of her notes. She names programming variables after her. She even writes stories of them together. That's so gay! Sharing a domestic life. I love this. I love this. Probability of crush, 101%. Margin of error, 1%. Well, well, well. With Dr. Alfie's helping you, the show has no dramatic tension. We can't go on like this. But, but, this was just the pilot episode. Next up, more drama, more romance, more bloodshed. Till next time, darlings. And later, Metaton. <laughs> well, that was certainly something. I agree, I agree, that was certainly something. Well, let's explore, I guess. Wait, wait. Okay, well, fine, I'll talk to you then. Let me give you my phone number. <laughs> She's blushing. Then maybe if you need help, I could... <sighs> Where'd you get that phone? It's ancient. I got it from the ruins. It doesn't even have texting. <laughs> Wait a second, please. Is she making me a new phone? <laughs> Here, I upgraded it for you. It can do texting items. It's not a key. It's got a keychain. Can Alfie's do that to my phone IRL, please? I even signed you up for the underground's number one social network. Lit. Now we're officially friends. <laughs> <laughs> this is awkward. I'm going to the bathroom. Me too, Alfie's. I feel that. I feel that hardcore. It's a beat up figurine of a female human with cat ears. Oh shit, I know that. I know that chick. It's a teacup shaped like a yellow lizard. It's full of soda. That's nice. Alfie's is me. Alfie's is literally me. <laughs> it's a computer. It's assessing some kind of puzzle in Snowden. Um, uh, Lauren and I, <laughs> Lauren and I are like friends with the lady, uh, who works the cash register at 7-Eleven because we go there for a big gulp so often. A garbage can, but it's pretty cute. That's, it, it's, it's me. There, there I am. A garbage can. Hmm. Well, I guess I can't go that way. Let's go on over here. Check out the fridge. The fridge is filled with instant noodles and soda. Take a package of noodles? Sure. You got the instant noodles. Lit. It's a bag of dog food. It's half full. Alfie's... Alfie's doesn't have a dog. <laughs> Where is your dog? <laughs> oh, there she is. I mean, not the dog, but there's Alfie's. <laughs> Um, okay, I guess those are all empty or whatever. Oh, look, it's the tubby custard machine. Oh, I was just pressing, I wasn't pressing the right button. Pink goop drips from the strange machine. It's the, tu it's tubby custard. Oh, these books are labeled human history. Read one. You look inside a book. It's a comic book. A hideous android is running to school with toast in his mouth. Seems like it's late. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. History. <laughs> All these books are labeled human history. You look inside a book, it's a comic book. 
two scantily clad chef chefs are flinging energy pancakes at each other. <laughs> That's kinky. This does not strike you as very accurate. VHSs and DVDs of various cartoons. They're all labeled human history. All of these books are human. You look inside a book. It's a comic of a giant robot fighting a beautiful alien princess. So this strike is very accurate. Scientific books. They seem very dusty. And those are actual books. Scientific books. <laughs> those ones weren't a lie. Looks like Alfie's work table. Seems dusty. Aw, oh, anime! She's a weeb! <laughs> The wardrobe is full of dirty lab coats and a single clean dress. There are letters from many monsters here. Froggit, Snowy, Doggo. They're all unopened. Oh. It's a lamp with pink fish on the lampshade. There's no light bulb. That's unfortunate. This is a this is a cube. It's an incredible invention. We're not in use. This bed folds into an extremely easy to draw box. <laughs> Amazing. That's fantastic. Uh, hello, there's Metaton. It's a promo poster for Metaton's TV premiere. On the flap it says, thank you for making my dreams come true. I love Metaton. Even though he tries to kill me. <laughs> well, I mean, you know. Yeah, it's, it's all good. Hmm. I'm trying to think if I checked the trash can. I probably did. Oh yeah, I did. It was, uh, it was me. Alfie's updated status. Just realized I didn't watch Undyne fight the human. Sad. That's so sad. Uh, well, I know she's unbeatable. I'll ask her about it later. I eat. Um, <laughs> for now I gotta call up the human and guide them. That's me. Okay, I'll go this way. We. Oh, fuck. Here, here we go. Oh, Vulcan, what's up? Um, you know, uh, yeah, you know, live long and prosper and shit. I gave Vulcan a hug. It warms your heart and your whole body. Ouch, your defense strong. Uh, so lovely. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Oh, we're good. We're good. Vulcan's cheeks glow with a bright heat. Lit. We're too lit. Um, Alfie's updated status. Gonna call them in a minute. Yay. Do it. I'm ready. Um, you giving me enough warnings, I think. Um, save. The whooshing sound of steam and cogs. It fills you with determination. Save. Yay. Alfie's updated status. I hate using the phone. I don't want to do this. I'll make- oh. Me too. Me too, Alfie's. Um. Sunderplane. Sunderplane gets in the way, not on purpose or anything. Um. Hmm. Go ahead and approach Sunderplane. You get close to Sunderplane, but not too close. Huh? Human? Whoa. Oh, shit. I gotta get close to Sunderplane. Oh, no. Sunplane gives you a condescending barrel roll. <laughs> Let's uh, get a little closer. You get close to Sunplane, but not too close. Let's do it. Oh no, I got hit. I've been hit. Sunplane gives you a condescending barrel roll. Hmm, we did it. Yay, I love Sunplane. Sunplane is so cute. So kawaii. There we go. Um, I'm not sure what's this way, but I'm gonna go this way because that's an option. Oh. Oh. I want that. There's a fry pan laying on the ground. Will you take it? I will. I got the burnt pan. Um. Burnt pan. I'll use it. You quit the burnt pan. Go to my items, and let's go ahead and drop those. Well, lay shoes were thrown away. Yep, don't need those anymore. Oh no, that's not what I meant to do. Okay, there we go. Now we can go back to our mission. This way. 
Oh gee, I've had my car over the last digit for five minutes. Alfie's, Alfie's, you added me. <laughs> oh gee, I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna call. Ring, ring. Click. Whoever was calling hung up before you answered it. That's funny. Ring. Ah, uh, hi. So the blue lasers. Uh, I mean, Alfie's here. Hi. The blue lasers won't hurt you if you don't move. Orange ones, um, you have to be moving, and they, um, they won't, um, move through those ones. Uh, bye. That's me. Um, gee, I did it. Claws haven't shook like that since, since Undyne called me to ask about the weather. <laughs> That's funny. Wait, there's no weather down here. Why did she call me? Because she's into you, too. That's so cute. Oh! Oh, <gasps> oh. Oh no. I'm getting wrecked real good. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I'm, I'll move very slowly. Oh, oh no. Ah. Uh, I have one remaining health. Hey, hey, watch out. You're going to get really hurt. I can't watch this. I'm, di I'm disabling the lasers. There. Be careful, okay? What the fuck? I, you could have done that the whole time? I'm sorry, it's my fault you got hurt. I didn't explain the lasers well enough, and if I hadn't, if I hadn't, um, delayed using my hacking skills, I mean, sorry. Yeah. Well, I mean, thanks anyway, though. Huh. Oh my god, I forgot to tell them where to go. Cute pic of me right now. It's a photo of a garbage can with several pink glittery flitters over it. Filters over it. Hmm. Ring. Alfie's here. The the northern door will stay locked until you solve the puzzles on the right and left. I I think you should go to the right first. Okay, thanks. Oh, oh, I'm ready to jump. I jumped. Right. What's up? The way to work is blocked, so I had time to catch Metaton's show on my phone. The special effects were amazing today. That human almost looked real. Oh, yeah. You know. Metaton. Yeah, he's the most popular star in the underground. His fan club probably has at least two, no, three dozen members. Wow, like me. I, w um, I wonder if this would be unfun if I explained the puzzle. Unfun? Come on now, I'm trying to like... The door leading through the area is closed, so I tried the puzzle, but I kept running out of ammo, and I kept restarting, and my two co-workers won't help. It's like they don't even want to go to work. Well, why are you making everything a question? Shoot the opposing ship, move the boxes to complete your mission. I eat. Got him. Congratulations. Thanks. I did it. Oh, okay. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. This way. Ring. Another laser, huh? I'm sorry, I won't play around this time. Hold on a second. Thanks, fam. Finally, someone turned off that laser. Now that we're free, we can, well, uh, I guess we'll just keep standing here. <laughs> I feel that. We were hanging out when suddenly, a bunch of puzzles reactivated out of nowhere. This is a huge problem. It rules. They've gotta cancel school over this. Me. Honestly, me. So much me. Okay. Let's get it. No, we know what's up. Um... Let's... We're... We're being real speedy. Okay. Now we can go up. Awesome. Dramatic. Alfie's updated status. Whatever, I'll just explain it. I already did it, Alfie's. Ring, um, I think, um, hey, about the puzzles on the left and right. They're a bit difficult to explain, but... Oh, you already solved them? Awesome! Cool. Get going. Ring. 
Hey, it's kind of dark in there, isn't it? Don't worry. I'll hack into the light system and brighten it up. Oh. Oh no. Oh hey, what's up? Oh yes! Welcome beauties to the Underground's premiere cooking show! Yay! Cooking with the killer robots. My favorite. I love the show. Preheat your ovens because we've got a very special recipe for you today. We're going to be making a cake! My lovely assistant here will gather the ingredients. Everyone give them a big hand. Yay! We'll need sugar, milk, and eggs. Go for it, sweetheart. Okay, I'll get it. Uh, gotta get them in order. Found the sugar. Um, yep, milk. And eggs. Awesome. Here you go. Great job, just put them in the middle of this counter. Sweet. Perfect, great job, beautiful. We've got all the ingredients, we just need to bake the cake. Milk, sugar, eggs. Oh my, what a magnificent moment. How could I forget? We're missing the most important ingredient. Oh no. A human soul. No. Run. Run. Oh. Hello? I'm kind of in the middle of something here. Wait a second. Couldn't you make a... Couldn't you use a... Couldn't you make a substitution in the recipe? A substitution? You mean, use a different, non-human ingredient? Why? Uh, what if someone's... Vegan? <laughs> yes, vegan. That's a brilliant idea, Alfie's. Actually, I happen to have an option right here. Metaton brand, always convenient, human soul flavored substitute. A can of which is just over there on that counter. Wow, how convenient. Well, darling, why don't you go get it? Okay, well, I'll do that. I mean, I hate- I'd hate to know what this tastes like, but... <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> oh. What the fuck is happening now? By the way, our show runs on a strict schedule. If we can't get the can in the next one minute, we'll just have to go back to the original plan. So, better start climbing, beautiful. I eat. Ring. Oh, no, that's not enough time to climb up. Fortunately, I might have a plan. When I was upgrading your phone, I added a few features. You see that huge button that says jetpack? Watch this. <laughs> that is too lit. I want my phone to do that. There. You should have just enough fuel to reach the top. Now, get up there. Let's do it. Yay. Uh, get him. <laughs> oh, okay. Hmm. Here we go. Here we go. Is that the milk? <laughs> so I guess that's the sugar. Maybe. Or, what the fuck? I'm so confused. No, that's the sugar. What was the- Oh no! Okay. This is milk. Uh, these are eggs. That's what these are. This is a sugar. Oh shit. I'm getting so wrecked. Oh no. They're gonna eat me. They're gonna put me in the cake. Oh goodness gracious. Did I do it? My my. It seems you bested me. But only because you had the help of the brilliant Dr. Alfie's. Oh, I love to think of what would have happened to you without her. Well, toodles. Oh yes, about the substitution. How much have you ever seen a cooking show before? I already baked the cake ahead of time, so forget it. <laughs> You're right. Ring. Wow, we we did it. We we really did it. Great job out there, team. Well, um, anyway, let's keep heading forward. You got it. There we go. Moving moving on from all that. An ominous structure looms in the distance. You're filled with determination. Let's get going. Ring. See that building in the distance? That's the core, the source of all power for the underground. It converts geothermal energy into magical electricity by... Uh, anyway, that's, that's where we're going to go. And the core is an elevator directly to Asgore's castle. 
and from there you can go home lit that's so dank I'm ready I'm ready to go home Please select a location. Uh, shit dog. I don't know. Let's go up, I guess. Or am I still going down? Oh, hey, what's up? Huh. I'm Heat's Flamesman. Remember my name. Okay. That's That there is Heat's Flamesman. Oh, there's sand. I love hot dogs. Hey, isn't it weird there's snow on that guy's roof? Guess he's just too lazy to clean it off. <laughs> yeah, that's that's what's weird about it. Toasty bun. I agree. Hey buddy, what's up? Wanna buy a hot dog? It's only 30 G. Sure. Thanks, kid. Here's your dog. Yeah, dog. Apostrophe dog. It's short for hot dog. Thanks, Sans. Hmm. Alfie's posted a picture. Dinner with the girlfriend. It's a picture of a cat girl figuring next to a bowl of instant noodles. I feel that so hard. Cool Skeleton 95 posts a picture. Are we posting hot pics? Here is me and my cool friend. It's a picture of Papyrus flexing in front of a mirror. He is wearing sunglasses. Giant muscular biceps are pasted onto his arms. The biceps are also wearing sunglasses. I love Papyrus. Papyrus is fave. Pyro bounds towards you. Oh. Um, cool. Um, Pyro bounds towards me. Shit, well, I don't know what this is. You invite Pyro up to hang out. Sorry, I'm all tied up. God damn it. I hate this. Oh no! Okay, smells like rope burn. Let's heat him up. You crank up the thermostat. Power up begins to get excited. Hot, hot, hotter, hotter. <laughs> that, that that does sound like excitement. If we're being real. Power up once more heat. Let's do it. You crank up the thermostat. It's super hot. Power up looks satisfied. Hot, hot, hotter, hotter. Oh. <laughs> that was real close. Oh man, you... Mm. Things are going faster. The room is sweltering. Bye, you won. Lit. Alfie's updated status. LOL, cool skill to 95. That's a joke, right? I love Papyrus. The only joke here is how strong my muscles are. Nuff's Blue has sent me a friend request. Of course. It seems to have already rejected itself. That's funny. There's an apron lying on the ground. Will you take it? Yeah, sure. You got the stained apron. Cool. Let's go ahead and equip that. You equip the apron. <laughs> Let's drop this. Faded ribbon was thrown away. Oh. Um. Hold on. Hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna find a, a safe place. Was there one by Sans? Uh, there wasn't. That's unfortunate. Well, I'm gonna find a place to save. And then, um, I think, I think we still need to go, um, hang out with Papyrus and Undyne. Like Papyrus proposed when Undyne was trying to kill me that one time. So we'll go down. We'll go down and we'll do that right quick. I think. Um, yeah I do. Let's go to Waterfall. I can't remember if we did this yet. I don't think we did. Ah, here we go. Tra la la. Uh oh, suddenly, feeling tropical. I don't, I don't get it. Hold on. <laughs> there we are. Thanks. Come again sometime. Tra la la. Yeah, I'll be back in a sec. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Let's see. 
Oh, hey, Papyrus. Yes. Oh, ho, the human arrives. Are you ready to hang out with Undyne? I have a plan to make you two great friends. I, I will. Yeah, let's hang out. Okay, stand behind me. <laughs> Psst. Make sure to give her this. She loves these. <laughs> he just puts it back in his pocket. Hi, Papyrus. Ready for your extra private one-on-one -on -one training? That sounds kinky. You bet I am. And I brought a friend. Hashtag surprise orgy. Hi, I don't think we've... Oh, no. Why don't you two come in? <laughs> Papyrus is so excited. Here, Undyne. My friend brought a gift for you. On their own. Uh, thanks. I'll, um, put it with the others. <laughs> wow, subtle. So are we ready to start? Whoopsie doopsie, I just remembered. I have to go to the bathroom. You two have fun. <laughs> Later, virus. <laughs> That's me in every social situation. So why are you here? To rub your victory in my face? To humiliate me even further? Is that it? No. Then why are you here? Wait, I get it. You think that I'm gonna be friends with you, huh? Right? Yes. <laughs> really? How delightful. I accept. Let's all frolic in the fields of friendship. Not. Why would I ever be friends with you? If you weren't my house guest, I'd beat you up right now. You're the enemy of everyone's hopes and dreams. I will never be your friend. Now get out of my house. Dang, what a shame. I thought Undyne could be friends with you. But I guess I overestimated her. She's just not up to the challenge. Challenge? What? Papyrus, wait a second. Darn it. He thinks I can't be friends with you. Foo-hoo-hoo, what a joke. That laugh, though. I can make friends with a wimpy loser like you any day. I'll show him. Listen up, human. We're not just going to be friends. We're going to be besties. I'll make you like me so much, you won't be able to think of anyone else. Foo hoo hoo, that's, it's the perfect, the perfect revenge. That's what it is. Why don't you have a seat? Yeah, sure. Thanks. You sit down and progress? Yes. Comfortable? I'll get you something to drink. There's a lot of things. All set. What would you like? Okay. Hey, don't get up. Okay, what's happening? Hey, don't get up. You're the guest. Sit down and enjoy yourself. Um, why not just point to what you want? You can use a spear. Okay, cool. Um. Undyne. Yes, I want to drink Undyne. Oh, or sugar goes in tea. I'll drink the sugar. Soda, sickly yellow liquid. Hot chocolate, green cylinder. Or tea box, blatantly correct choice. <laughs> Interesting. Sword, acquired taste. That looks like all my options. Let's uh, let's drink Undyne. Are you hitting on me? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, what about the sword? Believe me, I would gladly give you your full, full of swords. If you weren't my beloved house guest. Uh, cool, okay. How about some sugar? That sugar's for the tea. I'm not gonna give you a cup of sugar. What, what do I do? What do I look like? The ice cream woman? Do human ice cream women terrorize humanity with energy spheres? Are there ice cream songs to prelude to destruction? Is that it? Yes. What? Really? That rules. I agree. <laughs> Let's have some soda. Oh, soda? Actually, even though you pointed to it, you don't look happy. Huh, that's fine. I think soda's gross too. It rots your teeth. It rots your mind. It rots your fighting spirit. Huh? Why do I have it? <laughs> Oh, I know why she has it, because Alfie's likes it. Ah, uh, they love each other. Hot chocolate. Let's have some of that. Oh, you want some hot chocolate? 
Wait, wait. I just remembered. That container's empty. I stopped getting it because it was always a hassle. Asgore kept getting marshmallows stuck in his beard. That's wild. Okay, let's go with the tea then. Tea, huh? Coming right up. Guess that's why it was the blatantly correct choice. There she goes. Making that there tea. It'll take a moment for the water to boil. Yeah, okay. There it goes. Wow. Okay, it's all done. Ooh. Oh, she got me the tea. Here we are. Cool. I'll drink it. Careful, it's hot. It's not that hot. Just drink it already. You take a sip of the tea. It's burning. But other than that, it's pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty good, right? Yeah, yeah, that, I think that too. Nothing but the best for my absolutely precious friend. Totes. Hey. You know, it's kind of strange that you chose that tea. You know, I tried to choose anything else. <laughs> Golden flower tea. That's Asgore's favorite kind. Actually, now that I think about it, you kind of remind me of him. You're both total weenies. <laughs> sort of. You know, I was a pretty hot-headed kid. Once, to prove that I was the strongest, I tried to fight Asgore. Emphasis on tried. I couldn't land a single blow on him. And worse, the whole time, he refused to fight back. I was so humiliated. Afterwards, he apologized and said something goofy. Excuse me, do you want to know how to beat me? I said yes, and from then on, he trained me. One day, during practice, I finally knocked him down. I felt bad, but he was beaming. I had never seen someone more proud to get their butt kicked. Anyway, long story short, he kept training me. And now I'm the head of the Royal Guard. So I'm the one who gets to train dorks to fight. Like, uh, Papyrus. <laughs> uh, that dork Papyrus. But, um, to be honest, I don't know if I can ever let Papyrus into the Royal Guard. Don't tell him I said that. He's just, well, I mean, it's not that he's weak. He's actually pretty freaking tough. It's just that he's... He's too innocent and nice. I mean, look, he was supposed to capture you, and he ended up being friends with you instead. I can never send him into battle. He'd get ripped into little smiling shreds. I want, I want Papyrus to be safe too. That's part of why I started teaching him how to cook, you know? So, um, maybe he can do something else with his life. Oh, sorry. I was talking for so long. You're out of tea, aren't you? I'll get you some more. Oh. Wait a second. Papyrus, his cooking lesson. He was supposed to have that right now. And if he's not here to have it, you'll have to have it for him. <laughs> oh man, we're getting a cooking lesson. <laughs> Wild. That's right. Nothing has brought Papyrus and I closer than cooking. Which means that if I give you his lesson, we'll become closer than you can ever imagine. Foo-hoo-hoo. -hoo. Afraid? You're gonna be best friends. We're gonna be friends, best friends. Let's start with the sauce. Envision these vegetables as your greatest enemy. Now, pound them to dust with your fists. How will you pound? I will pound Wimpy. You pet the vegetables in an affectionate manner. Oh my god, stop petting the enemy. <laughs> I'll show you how it's done. Rawr. <laughs> uh, we'll just scrape this into a bowl later. But for now, we add the noodles. Homemade noodles are the best. I got some instant noodles, but I just buy store brand. They're the cheapest. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, just put them in the pot. How will you put them in? Fiercely. I'll put them in carefully. 
They place the noodles in one at a time. They clink against the empty bottom. Nice. All right. Now it's time to stir the pasta. As a general rule of thumb, the more you stir, the better it is. Ready? Let's do it. Oh. Oh. Stir harder. I'm stirring as harder as I can. Harder. <laughs> I'm mashing that shit. Uh, let me do it. <laughs> oh man. Rip the pot. That's the stuff. All right, now for the final step. Turn up the heat. Let the stovetop symbolize your passion. Let your hopes and dreams turn into burning fire. Ready? We're just making spaghetti. <laughs> Don't hold anything back. Oh, let's do it. Turn it up all the way. Hotter. Hotter, darn it. I'm doing it. I'm, it's very hot. Hotter. Yeah, it's looking real hot. Wait, that's too... Oh, rip. And that was how we died. Oh no. Ah, uh, man. No wonder Papara sucks at cooking. <laughs> we should probably get out of here. So what's next? Scrapbooking? Friendship bracelets? Oh, who am I kidding? I really screwed this up, didn't I? I can't force you to like me, human. Some people just don't get along with each other. I like you. I understand if you feel that way about me. And if we can't be friends, that's okay. Because if we're not friends, it means I can destroy you without regret. Oh man, we're gonna fight again. I've been defeated and my house is in shambles. I haven't failed to befriend you. That's it. I don't care if you're my guest anymore. One final rematch. All out on both sides. It's the only way I can regain my lost pride. Now come on, hit me with all you got. Yeah. <laughs> She's like the weirdest battle cry. Undyne is letting you make the first attack. I will fake attack her. You pretend to swing at Undyne with all your might. <laughs> got him. What? That's the best you can manage? Even attacking at full force. You just can't muster the intent to hurt me, huh? Huh, <sighs> you know what? I don't actually want to hurt you either. What a majestic scene with her hair flapping in the wind. At first, I hated your stupid saccharine stick, but the way you hit me right now, it reminded me of someone I used to train with. Now I know you aren't just some wimpy loser. You're a wimpy loser with a big heart, just like him. Listen, human, it seems that you and Asgore are fated to fight, but knowing him, he probably doesn't want to. Talk to him. I'm sure you can persuade him to let you go home. Eventually, some mean human will fall down here, and I'll take their soul instead. That makes sense, right? <laughs> oh, and if you do hurt Asgore, I'll take the human souls, cross the barrier, and beat the hell out of you. That's what friends are for, right? <laughs> now, let's get the hell out of this flaming house. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Well, that was fun, huh? We'll have to hang out again another time. But, uh, somewhere else, I guess. In the meantime, I guess I'll go hang out with Papyrus. So if you need me, drop by Snowden, okay? Oh, and if you ever need help, just give Papyrus a ring, okay? Since we're both in the same spot, I'll be able to talk too. Well, see you later, punk. Lit. We did it. <laughs> you feel a calming tranquility? Yes. Um, I think, like, I would normally just end the episode here, but... I kind of screwed myself with the thumbnails, so now it's like, now this episode has to be, like, until after the fight with Muffet, so, I mean, I guess we're gonna, like, <laughs> hang out until then, so, pause, resume, so, I think, um, we are now on our way back to Hotland to resume the plot over there, um, so... Tra la la.
Go for a ride. Um, yeah, sure. Let's go to Hotland. Yep. Um, okay, so we were, we took the elevator back down to go back to Undyne and Papyrus. So now, Parala, Temi Village, the room before the Darkening Lantern Room. Did, I think I went down there, but I can't remember if I actually, like, explored while we were there. Or if I just, like, rushed by. Um, we'll, we'll go back there, too, eventually. Um, soon, probably. But I will do it. And we'll go talk to all the Temmies. Please select a location. Let's go to that one. And I think this is Heat's Flamesman is over here. Yep, there he is. Heat's Flamesman. Huh, I'm Heat's Flamesman. Remember my name? Yeah, I, yeah, I did. Look, I remembered. I. There's that squad. Hmm. Let's get moving. Okay, yeah, there was something down there that, that we got already. And there was this up here. Let's do this now. Art club, meet here. Next meeting, October 10th, 8 p.m. Cool. October 10th, 8 p.m. Should I come back at, on October 10th at 8 p.m. then? What the fuck, why am I stuck? No. Oh no. Oh no, I broke it. I broke the game. Oh? Okay, just kidding. Yeah, okay. Let's do that then. <laughs> um, ring. Hi, it's Dr. Alfie's. This puzzle is kinda, um, time something. You, you see those switches over there? You'll have to press all three of them within three seconds. I'll try to help you with the rhythm. Rhythm, yes. We'll go back to that little space later. Shit, dude, what the heck? Okay, now press the third one. What the fuck, Alfie's? You fucking called me when I was gonna press it. Hey, hey. Looks like you only need to press two of them. Cool. How convenient. Okay. Always updated status. That's the last time I tried to help with the puzzle, LMAO. Ring. Uh, hey. I'm going to the bathroom, so I'll be MIA for a bit. I'm, I'm sure you can handle this puzzle yourself. That's funny. Alrighty. Okay. I guess. Um. All right. Sure. Well, fuck. Hmm. Real mystery this is. Uh. Damn, dude. Here we go. Let's go ahead and, uh... Um... Shit. What the heck? Um... Okay. I mean... How the fuck? What would happen if I just jumped to the left there on that other one? I just jumped to my death. Um, do I need to start over or something? Can I even start over? Oh, it hop. Okay. We'll get me back over here. Gotcha. I. Huh. So I can't jump from here to there when it, it would be the right time to. So I guess I'm not going from there. Uh. 
Uh, I'm going from someplace else. Hmm. Um. Well, shit. Uh, okay. I, I didn't figure it out or anything, but... <laughs> I mean... I don't know, fucking... Let's keep- just keep popping. I- what the fuck? I did not mean to do that. Hmm. Okay. Well... Let's do that, I guess. Just kidding. Wait. Yes. Genius. Hashtag so smart. OMG, people think Mew Mew 2 is better than Mew Mew 1. Oh well, that's a joke, right? Now she's going on her rants. Uh, her toilet rants. Knowing the mouse might one day hack the computerized safe and get the cheese. Fills you with determination. Cool. Squeak. And I guess this is the safe. There's a piece of cheese inside the computerized laser safe. The lasers have melted the edges of the cheese. It's stuck to the table. OMG, don't they get it ruins... Mew Mew's entire character arc? I feel that. My Mew Mew 2 review. Mew Mew Kissy Cutie 2 is neither kissy nor cutie. It's trash. Zero stars. <laughs> trash. Oh man. Slay. Hey, you, stop. A we've like received an anonymous tip about a human wearing a striped shirt. They told us they were wandering around Hotland right now. I know, sounds scary, huh? Well, just stay chill. We'll bring you someplace safe, okay? Thanks. Huh? What is it, bro? The shirt they're wearing? Like, what about it? Bro. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Bummer, this is like, mega embarrassing. We like, actually totally had to kill you and stuff. That's unfortunate. They attack me. Um, let's clean your armor. It's cooling dirt begins to wash away. Getting warmer, like team attack. Oh shit, fuck. Ah. Oh man. O2 watches your movements. Watch me die. This next one. Let's get all that cooling dirt. Oh, oh shit. No. Can't take it. Armor to haunt. Oh, now he's shirtless. Much better. Our one looks bothered by something. That's amazing. I'm gonna have uh, insta nude. <laughs> I'm gonna have my hot dog. You eat the hot dog? Your HP was maxed out. Nice. Okay. That's not nice. Oh. Sweat pours from O2's armor. R1. Whisper. You tell R um, RG1 to be honest with his feelings. I. I. <sighs> oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Dude. I can't. I can't take this anymore. Not like this. Like, O2, I like, I like, like you, bro. The way you fight, <laughs> the way you talk. I love doing team attacks with you. I love standing here with you, bouncing and waving our weapons in sync. <laughs> O2, I like, want to stay like this forever. <laughs> Hashtag no homo. Uh. I mean, uh, Said gotcha, bro, haha. <laughs> oh, one? Yeah, bro? Do you want to 
get some ice cream after this? Sure, dude, haha. <laughs> Yay. Lit. Ah, oh, that's so cute. They're going to get their ice cream. Oops, wait, how's the humans doing? How's the human doing? That's me. Top 10 shows that make you forget to do your freaking job. I agree. Um... Is, uh, is this Metaton again? Ring? Okay, I'm back. Another dark room, huh? Don't worry. My hacking skills have got things covered. Yep, there he is. Are you serious? Oh, yes! Good evening, beauties and gentle beauties. This is Metaton reporting live from MTT News. An interesting situation has arisen in Eastern Hotland. Fortunately, our correspondent is out there, reporting live. Brave correspondent, please find something newsworthy to report. Our ten wonderful viewers are waiting for you. Our ten wonderful viewers. How about this? Oh my! It's a completely nondescript descript, uh, glass of water. Okay. If anything can make a great story with enough spin, report this one. Let's do it. Attention viewers! Our correspondent has found a glass of water. But what's astonishing about this glass of water is how uninteresting it is. Like all glasses of water, it's comprised of water, glass, nitroglycerin. Wait a second. That's not a glass of water. That's a bomb. <laughs> oh no, this news report is turning into a disaster report. But don't panic. You haven't even seen the rest of the room yet. Oh. Oh my. It seems everything in this area is actually a bomb. That dog's a bomb. That basketball's a bomb. Even my words are. <laughs> Brave correspondent, if you don't defuse all the bombs, this big bomb will blow you to smithereens in two minutes. Then he won't be reporting live any longer. How terrible. How disturbing. Our nine viewers are going to love watching this. We lost one. Good luck, darling. I eat. Don't worry. I installed the bomb diffusing program on your phone. Of course you did. Use the diffuse option when the bomb is in the defuse zone. Now go get him. I eat. I got it. Look at the fucking glass of water. Go. Okay. Uh, boop. Yay, dog was diffused. I'm a hero. Great job. Keep heading around the room. Try to go for the one in the bottom left next. Okay. I mean, I don't know why specifically, but I... That one. Okay. Here we go. Got him. Lit. This theme is like so lit though. Okay. Script bomb. <laughs> Got him. That's too dank. Um, let's go here. Defuse the present. Okay. There we go. Lit. There's this basketball here flying around all over the place. Okay. You got it. Sweet. Great job. Head for the center. I'm using a... EM files to trap the glass of water there. Got it. Refuse the extremely agile glass of water. Ah. Uh. Oh shit. Well. Lit. Well done, darling. You deactivated all of the bombs. If you didn't deactivate them, the big bomb would have exploded in two minutes. Now it won't explode in two minutes. Instead, it'll explode in two seconds. Goodbye, darling. Oh, that's not good. I guess I'll just stand here. Ah, it seems the bomb isn't going off. That's because while you were monologuing, I, I fixed, um, to change. Oh no, you deactivated the bomb with your hacking skills. Yeah, that's what I did. <laughs> Curses, it seems I've been foiled again. Curse you, human. Curse you, Dr. Alphys, for helping so much. But if I don't curse my eight wonderful 
but I don't curse my eight wonderful viewers for turning tuning in. We lost another one again. Until next time, darling. Wow, we really showed him, huh? Hey, I know I was kind of weird at first. You're still kind of weird, Alfie's. But I really think I'm getting more, uh, more, more confident about guiding you. So don't worry about that big dumb robot. I'll protect you from him. And if it really came down to it, I could just turn. Um, never mind. Later. Click. Something suspicious going on here. It's so quiet now. We had all that epic music playing that whole time, and now there's like literally nothing. Alright, well. I mean, I guess those are sounds. Ring. Um. I notice you've been kind of quiet. <laughs> yeah, you know, yeah, I don't really talk. Are you worried about meeting Asgore? Well, don't worry, okay? The king is a really nice guy. I'm sure you can talk to him, and with your human soul, you can pass through the barrier. So no worrying, okay? Just forget about it and smile. You got it. I'll just, I'll do that. Oh, here we are, another elevator. Please select a location. This one. We're moving up in the world. Here we are. Okay, there's carpet here. Hey, what's up? Welcome to our parlor, dearie. Interested in some spider pastries? All proceeds go to real spiders. It looks like some sort of powerful bracelet. Wait, it's just a croissant. It's a donut. It's a spider donut. It looks more rubbery than usual. Spider bake sale. All proceeds go to real spiders. Buy a spider donut for 9999 Gee, no thank you. Buy a spider cider for the same price. No thanks. I, I, I ended up buying a donut. I, I, I didn't want to, but that girl, even though I told her no, she... Kept staring at me in this creepy way and licking her lips. N now I'm out of cash. That sucks, bro. Hashtag peer pressure. Hi, Alfie's here. This room is like the room we saw before. There are two puzzles in the north and south. You'll have to solve them both to proceed. Uh, also, I'd like to say, I don't really like giving away puzzle solutions, but if you need help, just call me, okay? Actually, wait. I have an idea. Let's be friends on Undernet. Then you can just ping me when you need help. We already are friends. Wait. We're already friends, aren't we? I signed you up, didn't I? You've been reading my posts the whole time. Well, I hope you agree with me about me, Mew, too. <laughs> wow. Goddamn Alfie's. You were talking about me on there. Okay. Um. Guess I'll go down first. South. Here we go. Shit! Um... <laughs> oh. Oh no. Okay. Oh no. Oh no! Oh fuck, I could've just stayed still the whole time too. God damn it. Ring. Hey! This, um, doesn't have anything to do with guiding you, but... Uh, hey, would you want to watch a human TV show together? Sometime? It's called, um, Mew Mew Kissy Cutie. Sure. Really? It's so good. It's, um, my favorite show. It's all about this human girl named Mew Mew. Okay. Uh, that's cool. That's cool, Alfie. It's interesting. Yeah, wow, spoilers. You're just telling me like the whole plot. I mean, okay, I'm not pre I'm not pressing anything by the way. She's just talking really fast. And um eventually she realizes, okay, okay. You t <laughs> okay, uh I think you'd really like it. We should watch it after you get through all this. Yeah, let's do that. Um, I'll do this first. And I only have one. That's nice. Uh, well, fuck. 
Um. Okay. Lit. Congratulations. Let's move on. There's a cactus there. Okay. Okay, well shit. I fucked myself again. Um, yes. Cool. This way. What? Oh no. Thunderplane attacks. Not because the shell is Vulcan is paying attention to you. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. You eat the cinnamon bunny. Your HP was maxed out. It's not like I like you. Okay, 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 okay. Shit, dude. Shit. What the fuck? Um. Let's give you a nice little hug. You gave Vulcan a hug. It warms your heart. And your whole body. Ouch, your defense dropped. Oh, so lovely. Okay, 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 okay. Lit. Let's go ahead and... An idiot! Oh no, I died. When was the last time I saved? Oh, I'm dead now. It cannot end now. Fajnib, stay determined. Oh man. Okay, cool. Not not so much to make up here. Awesome. Um and we went this way. <laughs> yes. Cool. Alright. Oh, you two again. That's cool. I'll just go ahead and hug you now. Give Vulcan a hug. It warms your heart and your whole body. Ouch, your defense dropped. Oh, so lovely. Oh, fuck. Fuck. No. Vulcan's cheeks glow with a bright heat. It's not like I like you. I'm so fucked. No! Oh, I died again. Why is this so hard? <laughs> uh. Yeah, I'm gonna be alright. Stay determined. Let's get going. Oh my god. <sighs> Maybe I should just like run. Who needs gold anyway, right? Okay. Wow. Well, I mean. Oh, damn it. Okay, well, fine. Maybe I'll try approaching you first. Human? Oh my god, no. Oh no. Oh no. Vulcan is making coffee in its crater. Um. Let's approach you a little more. You're hurt, I'll help it says. Oh god. Vulcan is wiggling its weird rump. You're hurt, I'll help. With what? With what? <laughs> Vulcan! <laughs> Vulcan reassures you the plane turning tiny is like completely intentional. What? <laughs> Okay, let's uh, let's hug him. Ouch. Okay, please don't hurt me. No. Oh. Okay. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Sweet. Um. Okay. Um, sweet. 
Congratulations. Oh, hey. You guys weren't here before. My fave Metaton moment, TM. Right when everything looks the baddest, he poses dramatically. Like when he's on a cooking show and the eggs don't turn out right. <laughs> That's funny. Our fave Metaton moment is when he beats up the heel-turning villains. Even if it's during what's supposed to be a quiz show. <laughs> okay. Let's... Now let's go to the right. Um... Let's figure out how to go to the right first. Okay, sweet, sweet, sweet. We did it. Now the doors will open up and we can move on. Sweet. Save. The smell of cobwebs fills the air. You're filled with determination. I. Spider entrance, it said. Ooh. Ooh. Did you hear what they just said? They said a human wearing a striped shirt will come through. I heard that they hate spiders. I heard that they love to stomp on them. That's not good. That's not good for me. I heard that they like to tear their legs off. I don't like to do those. I don't like to do any of those things, you know? I love spiders. Spiders are pretty lit. I heard... That they're awfully stingy with their money. <laughs> you think their taste is too refined for our pastries, don't you, dearie? I disagree with that notion. I think your taste is exactly what this next batch needs. And she giggles. Muffet traps you! That's not good. Uh, I'm gonna start struggling. You struggle to escape the web. Muffet covers her mouth and giggles at you. Don't look so blue, my dearie. Wait. I think purple is a better look on you. Now I'm purple. I'll keep struggling. You struggle to escape the web. Muffet laughs, laughs and claps her hands. Why so pale? You should be proud. Oh. That's cool. That's cool. Muffet pours you a cup of spiders. Just keep struggling. You struggle to escape the web. Muffet is so amused by your antics that she gives you a discount. Proud that you're going to make a delicious cake. I... Um... Oh, fuck. Shit, shit, shit. Muffet pours you a cup of spiders. I'll just keep escaping and hope for the best. Let you go. Don't be silly. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. I almost missed that. It's so hardcore. We're good. We're good. All the spiders clap along to the music. You struggle to escape the web. Nothing happened. Your soul is going to make every spider very happy. I think I'll start sparing next turn. Oh, God. I'm gonna die here. Stuck in this web. With a spider let it you. Um, laughing at me. All the spiders clap along to the music. Spare. Oh, how rude of me. I almost forgot to introduce you to my pest. My pet. That's what it is. It's breakfast time, isn't it? Have fun, you two. Oh, my. That's, uh, that's real interesting. Um. Yeah, okay, 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 okay. Oh. Hey, what's up? Hey, that's, uh, that's nice. That's nice. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Um, let's, ooh, okay. It's so weird, it's like so disorienting. Uh, I should let's eat that spider donut. Don't worry, spider didn't. Your HP was maxed out. Huh, where did you get that? Did you steal it? Oh, my pet, it's time to show them what we do to thieves. Huh? A telegram from the spiders in the ruins? What? They're saying that they saw you and you helped donate to their cause. Oh my, this has all been a big misunderstanding. I thought you were somebody that hated spiders. Yeah, I did buy that. I, I bought that with my own money. The person who asked for that soul, they must have met a different human in a striped shirt. Yeah, totally. Sorry for all the trouble. <laughs> I'll make it up to you. You can come back here anytime, for, and for no charge at all. I'll wrap you up and let you play with my pet again. Just kidding. 
I'll spare you now. Let's do it. Yay. That was fun. See you again, Derry. Yay. She's so cute. <laughs> okay. Well, we did it. There was Muffet. Spider Lady. It's a poster from Metaton's latest stage performance. A tragic tale of two star-crossed lovers kept apart by the tides of fate. Looks like it's almost time for the performance. Oh. I guess we'll go see that then. Oh? That human. <laughs> Could it be? My one true love? <laughs> oh god. Here we are. The performance is beginning. <laughs> uh, that's wild, Metaton. <laughs> there he goes. Oh, I'm being serenaded. <laughs> that's Asgore, I guess. <laughs> Oh, do you want to see humans all the time? Oh my god, the rose petals. <laughs> oh. I have OBS in the background with the same, like, like, with Undertale showing. But it's like, like, OBS is overlapping. So it looked like the petals were going off the, off the tab for Undertale for a second. <laughs> <laughs> so sad. Is he gonna kill me now? So sad. So sad that you are going to the dungeon. Well, toodles. Uh, yeah, I gay. Okay, well. Kind of saw that coming. Oh no, whatever shall I do? My love has been cast away into the dungeon. A dungeon with a puzzle so dastardly, my paramour will surely perish. Oh, heavens have mercy, the horrible colored tile maze. Tile maze. Each colored tile has its own sadistic function. For example, a green tile sounds a noise and then you must fight a monster. Red tiles will... Actually, wait a second. Didn't we see this puzzle about a hundred rooms ago? Yep, that, that was the one Papyrus was showing me. That's right, you remember all the rules, don't you? Yep, totally. Great, then I won't waste your time repeating them. Okay, I guess I'll just go ahead and do it. Oh, and you'd better hurry. Because if you don't get through in 30 seconds, you'll be incinerated by these jets of fire. <laughs> uh, my poor love. I'm so filled with grief, I can't stop laughing. Good luck, darling. Thanks. Here we go. Why is it so fucking slow? What the fuck? Oh, oh no. I forgot that yellow does that. Shit. 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 Oh no. Uh, okay. Okay. Um, I don't fucking know what to do. Oh man. I can't go there now because of the orange. Wait, what the fuck? Was that a dog? No. Oh shit, well. Oh, I'm so sorry. It looks like you're out of time. Here come the flames, darling. They're closing in. Getting closer, oh my. Yeah, they're right up on me. Any minute now. Just fucking do it. <laughs> Robotic cough. <laughs> Ring. Watch out, I'll save you. I'm hacking into the firewall right now. The, f the firewall, God damn it. Oh no, how could this happen? Foiled again by the brilliant Dr. Alphys. You know, this all seems like a plan to me. Oh shit. That's right. Come on, Mediton. Give up already. You'll never be able to defeat us. Not as long as we work together. Your puzzle's over. Now go home and leave us alone. Puzzle? Over? Alfie's darling. What are you talking about? Did you forget what the green tiles do? They make a sound. Then you have to fight a monster. Well, darling, that monster is me. Oh, we're fighting now. Mediton attacks. 
Oh, shit. Well. Let's yell. You yell. Nothing happened. This is it, darling. Say goodbye. Is that your phone? You'd better answer it. Hey, this seems bad, but don't worry. There's one last thing I installed on your phone. You see that yellow button? Go to this phone's act menu and press it. Okay. Yellow. You press the yellow button. The phone is resonated with Metaton's presence. This is it, darling. Say goodbye. <laughs> That's kind of late. Now press Z. Oh, it's a gun. It's a gun button. Oh, oh. You defeated me. How can this be? You were stronger than I thought, etc. <laughs> he runs off. Ring. Looks like you beat him. You did a really great job out there. All thanks to you. What? Oh no, I mean... You were the one doing everything cool. I just wrote some silly programs for your phone. Um, hey, this might sound strange, but... Can I tell you something? Before I met you, I didn't really... I didn't really like myself very much. For a long time, I felt like a total screw-up. Like, I couldn't do anything without... Without ending up letting everyone down. But... Guiding you has made me feel a lot better about myself. So, thanks for letting me help you. Yeah, thanks, Dr. Alfie's. Uh, anyway, we're almost to the core. It's just past, um, MTT Resort. Come on, let's finish this. Let's do it. I'm ready. Oh, man, what a, what a ride. What a wild ride. <laughs> hey. Hey, it's you again. Business is excellent here. These two fellows brought all my ice cream. I've actually sold out of everything. Sorry. Wait, I've still got something for you. A big smile. How about that? How about fuck you? <laughs> oh, hey, Sans. Hey, go up to the creepy alleyway on the right for some great deals. Oh, man. Get the drugs. I'll go there next after I talk to Sans. Hey, I heard you're going to the core. How about grabbing some dinner with me first? Yeah, sure. Great, thanks for treating me. God damn it, Sans. Over here, I know a shortcut. Of course you do. He always knows a shortcut. Oh, here we are. Well, here we are. So, your journey's almost over, huh? You must really want to go home. Hey, I know the feeling, Beto. Though, maybe sometimes it's better to take what's given to you. Down here, you've already got food, drink, friends. Is what you have to do really worth it? Um, forget it. I'm rooting for you, kid. Is he talking about Asgore? Hey. Let me tell you a story. So I'm a sentry in Snowden Forest, right? I sit out there and watch for humans. It's kind of boring. Fortunately, deep in the forest, there's this huge locked door. It is perfect for practicing knock-knock jokes. <laughs> so one day, I'm knocking him out, like usual. I knock on the door and say, knock, knock. And suddenly, from the other side, I hear a woman's voice. Who is there? So, naturally, I respond, Dishes. Dishes who? Dishes a very bad joke. Then she just howls with laughter. I like it. Like it's the best joke she's heard in a hundred years. That's Toriel. I know her. So I keep him coming, and she keeps laughing. She's the best audience I've ever had. Then, after a dozen of them, she knocks and says, Knock, knock. I say, who's there? Old lady. Old lady who? Oh, I did not know that you could yodel. Well, needless to say, this woman was extremely good. <laughs> I agree. We kept telling each other jokes for hours. Eventually, I had to leave. Papyrus gets kind of cranky without his bedtime story. Papyrus is so cute. But she told me to come by again, and so I did. Then I did again, and again. It's a thing now. Telling bad jokes through the door. It rules. <laughs> Totes. One day, though, I noticed she wasn't laughing very much. I asked her what was up. 
Then she told me something strange. If a human ever comes through this door, could you please, please promise me something? Watch over them and protect them, will you not? Now, I hate making promises. And this woman, I don't even know her name, but someone who sincerely likes bad jokes, has an integrity you can't say no to. Do you get what I'm saying? That promise I made to her. You know what would have happened if she hadn't said anything? Buddy. You'd be dead where you stand. <laughs> Shit, dude. <laughs> Fucking sands. Hey, lighten up, bucko. I'm just joking with you. Besides, haven't I done a great job protecting you? I mean, look at yourself. You haven't died a single time. Hey, what's that look supposed to mean? Am I wrong? Yeah, you, you're pretty wrong. I died a ton. Huh. Well, that's all. Take care of yourself, kid. Because someone really cares about you. Bye, Sans. Thanks for that good chat. That was pretty wild. Hey, what's up? Originally, we dug mazes with puzzles in order to foil human attacks. But now, building things winding and confusing is some awful tradition. You can't go, ugh, two feet without being up to your armpits and puzzles. <laughs> I feel that. It is kind of a problem around here. I work at the core. The inside is a maze made of swappable parts. That means we can shuffle the layout at will. Boy, was today a fun day. I sure love puzzles. Wow. <laughs> And they're both sitting together. I'm the resort comedian. I'm very funny. People laugh at my jokes. Now, my son, he wants to be a comedian like his father. But his jokes aren't funny. He tells these awful puns. He's an embarrassment to our family. Ha 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 ha. That's not funny. Since his mother passed on, he couldn't stand. He couldn't live at home anymore. So he ran away. I haven't seen him since. I'm a terrible father. Ha 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 ha. That's not funny. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> oh, hey, what's up? Blub blub. You'll have to reserve a table to eat here. You'll also need to reserve your chair, your silverware, your food, your... Interesting. I think I'll pass. Okay, let's save. The relaxing atmosphere of this hotel, it fills you with determination. Cool. And I think we'll end the episode there. We, we, we've gotten very far. I think... The core is like right right up there. And um, I think that we're gonna Um I think I think that's just like like right after we get through the core it's, there's Asgore, so you know, that's pretty close. <laughs> so we're almost there. And we'll we'll go up there next time. And until then, bye bye.